Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Talkies with Giant Nero. And today we are back again with another update on the Unleash the Undead blog tour and today's stop is CBY Book Club, the blog of CBY Book Club. So yes, uh, don't forget to hit the link as usual. Not for the rest of the tour, um, it is down below, and click on that, and then all the other links and stuff. You know the drill by now. It's, it's we know we know what we're doing by now, Johnny. What you don't need to tell us these things anymore. But um, yeah, uh, do that. Hit that. Don't forget to enter the competition as always to enter to to win. Oh, I've got my cup of tea. Hmm. To win the um, paperback copy of Unleash the Undead. There it is, you can see right there with me, it's just accompanied me throughout the entire of the tour, just as you guys have, because you guys are fantastic. Um, a little bit extra on today's though, um, there was a really good question on one of the, um, on today's CBY Book Club stop, and it was, what authors inspire your work? And I think that's, that's worth talking about, I think there is, um, I wrote my answer on there, you'll see, you'll see, you will see it down there, there's like the comments section as there is. On all of the um, all of the things in the tour, but um, mine really. Uh, you've got Brent Weeks uh, for the Night Angel trilogy. I'd never ever heard of Brent Weeks until I read the Night Angel trilogy, and then there was um, this really like, oh my god, this is such a really awesome trilogy of books. And it's all like assassiny and stuff, and very 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 cool. And then there's a couple of other ones, a couple of other ones. I like Philip Pullman. For the dark materials, obviously, and there's um, who else was there? There was um, da -da 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 -da. Slavomir Rowitz, yeah, Slavomir Rowitz. I couldn't think of his name then. Cause it's like a, I don't think he's not a well-known author. In fact, he's uh, he was um, a prisoner of war in in World War Two, I think, or World War One, and he had to escape from a from a prison camp. And it basically the story, the long walk, is. Uh, was given to me by my granddad. It's a, the original copy, so it's very, very old. It's 19 something. I don't know. I'll, I'll try and find it somewhere. It's put away safe because I don't want to lose it. It's like very, very close to my heart. But um, yeah, I, my granddad gave me that, and I've read that so many times. It's just such a good account of what what he used to go through and stuff. And he's just kind of like, what the, what the fuck? This is insane. <laughs> it's really cool. So yeah, Slavomir Rowitzson. And and they're all all have one thing in common. They're all really really descriptive authors, and I try to to mirror that in my own work. I don't know if I um I don't know if I succeed, but I do try I do try to mirror that in my work. So yeah, um, those are my uh, those are my three favorite authors. Three, four, some some of my favorite authors. not favorite but my inspiring authors. Um, so yeah, that, that my my actual proper answer is on the blog. So don't forget to check that out. And uh, talk, comment yourself, comment on whatever you want to comment on because it's open, it's open, you talk about whatever you want. Uh, ask questions, uh, anything, anything. And um, that's it, really, tomorrow is the final day of the blog tour. Ooh. Oh, I'm going to miss doing this, it's quite fun. Um, but yeah, tomorrow is the final day of the blog tour, I think it's another double stop. And I'll make a, a nice special video to, to send off what has been a fantastic couple of weeks so um, thank you again for watching um, and putting up with my rambling for so long and uh, I'll check out links down below and don't forget to don't forget to have an absolutely lovely day and I will see you tomorrow for more for the final update on the Unleashed the Undead blog tour see you later